Once again, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, good evening, film lovers, good evening, lovers of African entertainment. Welcome to this special broadcast session on Apex One Radio, devoted to the live coverage of the movie premiere of A Man for the Weekend, a latest Cameroonian movie that has gained a lot of... Uh, Publicity within the past couple of weeks, it is produced by frontline Cameroonian actress and producer Cindy Emade and her Blue Rain Entertainment. This movie was first launched on the 28th of October 2017, that is barely one week ago at the Canal Olympia in Douala. And today, the population of Yawundi will have the privilege of discovering this new product in the African entertainment market and it is at the Hilton Hotel in Yaoundé where this movie will be officially made public and screened to the public and so it is a red carpet event from where Valérie Dulafe will be giving us minute by minute uh, commentaries just to mention that a man for the weekend is uh, starring Cindy Imade uh, Alex a Kobo, Solange Ojong, Chifo, Valerie, and a couple of other frontline actors. It is directed by Ashil Bryce. And so, without much ado, we are going to move over to Yawunde, Cameroon, from where Valerie Tatadulafe has been on standby. That will be in just a couple of seconds. of music there by Alexis Emil Cameroonian frontline gospel music artist based in the United States of America. We understand that the movie premiere of A Man for the Weekend has begun at the Yaoundé Hilton Hotel in Yaoundé, Cameroon. And without much ado, let's get there and find out just what has been happening. Valérie Tata Dulafe is our man on the ground. And from there, he now joins us. Valérie, welcome to the show. Good afternoon, and what is happening over there now? Hello, Ernest. Welcome to uh, the Yaoundé Hilton Hotel once more. Uh, welcome to Red Carpets and Royalty. Right now, uh, we are having uh, the projection of... Uh, a man for the weekend after Duola. Right now we are in a young day for these uh, anticipated and distinguished uh, events. Definitely, it is a trust ceremony attended here by uh, so many uh, people. Definitely, uh, this is the second phase of the particular program, and uh, uh, we are having quite a great time here. So, uh, welcome once more to the on the Hilton Hotel, where uh, the premiere of uh, a man for the weekend. It's actually in high class. Welcome, Ernest. Welcome, Valerie, and thanks for indicating your presence. I understand that the event started, um, if not an hour ago, maybe more. Uh, uh, but then, um, I'd like to find out from you what transpired uh, before now. So, how was the red carpet? Who did you see walking into uh, the hall? And who is who at the Yonder Hilton Hotel this evening, Valerie? 
definitely it's been a, a, a great red carpet event here in Escanjo. Definitely, uh, most of you are uh, celebrity, or uh, I mean, a great host of uh, celebrities are uh, definitely here. We we had as promised a whiz boy from uh, Nigeria who is uh, present here in Yaoundé and the Hilton Hotel to actually support this event. We also have uh, artists such as uh, New America who just stepped in here. And also we have Blanche Bailey who performed uh, for the distinguished uh, guests, ladies and gentlemen, who were here uh, to actually witness this particular uh, event. Now, uh, amongst uh, those uh, present here also, we have actors and actresses. We have uh, Ocha Vitalis who actually uh, stepped in as we were speaking. We had uh, so Honsho John who is actually one of the, the actresses in this particular event. We have uh, Valerie Chifo who is actually also uh, uh, one of the actors in this particular uh, event. We have uh, Cynthia Gala also who actually took part in this particular uh, uh, film. We also have, uh, of course, uh, Cindy Amado, who is present. She happens to be uh, the lead uh, actress in this particular film or movie. And she's actually present. Or oh, here, she'll be giving a talk at the end of uh, this particular uh, ceremony. And the host for tonight is Nene, Nene Shaziga, who is actually from CRTV. Uh, we have uh, a whole lot of uh, CRTV uh, the professionals here. We have also Myra uh, from Hello CRTV. We have Chichi. We have the... I mean, a great host of uh, people who are here today dressed to kill in their uh, beautiful uh, suits and uh, gowns. Definitely, it is a uh, glamour ceremony, and definitely, it is uh, a must-watch movie. Now, it is uh, the projection that is currently going on. I must tell you, wow, class, 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 and royalty, right, represented here. You just talked of class, and I understand that when it comes to Cindy Emade, it is about class. Tell me, um, when you looked at the faces of the guests to that event this evening, uh, did you observe excitement, anxiety? Just tell me, uh, how was the feeling? Of course, it is uh, a great feeling of uh, expectation right here, because many people, uh, definitely, they came to... Uh, to see what this thing is all about. You know, uh, Cindy Amada is uh, the brand ambassador for uh, Solita. Mm -hmm. Definitely, uh, she is the brand ambassador for a year now. And for those of you who know Cindy Amada, her face has been the talk of the day. She's one-time uh, Cameroon model, uh, one-time uh, actress, and uh, still actress. Mm -hmm. She's definitely the new face of Solita. And uh, many people are coming today to actually see what this gorgeous face has, apart from her face what she can deliver, what she can offer when it comes to the Cameroon film industry. And definitely, uh, many people, when I question many people here, uh, uh, unfortunately, everybody's in the hall watching the film, or watching the, the premiere, people were like, uh, okay, I, I would like to see uh, this lady in a new angle because she has been a lot into charity works. She has been a lot into uh, advertising and stuff. So definitely, it is uh, a nice full of expectation. And many people are definitely... Uh, so much, so much waiting to see this particular movie. So it, it is a great movie, Ernest Kanjo. One of uh, the foreign actors starring in this movie is Nollywood's uh, Alex uh, Kobo. You haven't mentioned him yet. That may mean that he is not uh, present at the premiere this evening. Is that the case, Valerie? Oh, oh, well, I I came when it was already a little bit. Uh, Rugby people had already been in the hall. I've not yet spotted him yet, mm. and uh, it has been. Uh, uh, I'm still waiting for that particular that particular opportunity to to, to catch him, and definitely we'll, we'll talk. And uh, if if I see him, I'll definitely let you guys know. So that that's how it is, Ernest. And uh, we are still waiting on maybe a glimpse to catch this particular personality. And definitely, if we do so, we will uh, give you uh, information first time and, 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 and first class when it comes to that. Maybe unless maybe I take some one or two people in the red carpet and when we go in, okay. and definitely we can we can definitely have uh, uh, maybe who is in, who is out, uh, and stuff like that. So definitely, it was uh, it is a great ceremony. Maybe maybe I get to somebody who actually performed uh, tonight. Good evening. How are you doing, sir? 
Yes, this is Apex One Radio from the United States of America, and you had a brilliant performance in there. So tell us a little bit. I know when we when we watched you a little bit, for those people who don't yet know you, those in the United States of America, can you uh, briefly tell us who this distinguished personality was? Oh, yes, my name is Christian, and I'm a comedian by the name Senior Pastor of the <laughs> Laughing Ministry. <laughs> and definitely uh, when you were introduced, many people seem to know you and you have performed internationally mm -hmm. as well as nationally. So tell us a little bit, what explains your raison d'etre here today? Uh, come again, please. But what explains you being here today? You are, no, really, if you are not here, like here, you are nowhere from now. Because <laughs> this is where it's happening, that the industry in Cameroon, the industry is booming and this is the, uh, the zenith of it, and we are here to support and see the lives, just enjoy with friends, mm -hmm. and they called me to perform, because they have musicians, and they in the comedian, and maybe they thought it right to choose a senior pastor, a comedian, so that's why I'm here to perform, and I was so blessed that one thing is to speak and people enjoy it, and uh, so, and I, and I spoke and they enjoyed it and people laughed at the, you know, you feel fulfilled if you perform and the people consume your product. So as a comedian in Cameroon, uh, we are going places and one day, one day, we also see me there in America. I've been there so many times. Fortunately, <laughs> I've been to so many, uh, so many states in America. But it come out for my dream. I've been there so many times in my dream. <laughs> 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 Thank you very much for having spoken to our text on radio. That was just a glimpse uh, for people who are listening to this particular program. Definitely, you did quite a great job. You did quite a great job, and definitely we'll come back to you in the course of this program. So thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So, and as that was for senior pastor, definitely, he is uh, uh, one of the comedians we have here in Cameroon. Definitely has been doing it quite big, and many people have. Uh, actually uh, appreciated what he's been doing on uh, today. So that is him, known as a senior pastor. And let's, I will try maybe to get some one or two people again who are actually starting out. Maybe uh, everybody, uh, people are still in the hall. And let's maybe I will, I will try to get one or two of them. Then I will come back to uh, see you in a couple of minutes. Right now, just a projection. And definitely that's why it's so difficult to have those people who are in here or who are out uh, inside the hall. So we'll definitely, we'll, we'll, we'll get to them when uh, the meeting arises and starts like that. So, Ernest, Before that's you, what we do with you. Hello, I'm going to to you. Valerie, it is the premiere of uh, a mindful of the weekend. Valerie, and definitely, it is a great and grand use of ceremony, Ernest. Valerie. One more question. Yes, Ernest. Yes, uh, before the transition, um, you mentioned a while ago that uh, Nigeria's Wiz Boy is uh, in the hall. Has he performed yet, or he is yet to do so? Nigerian Swiss boy has not yet performed, yes. But definitely maybe they're keeping the surprise for the end. Okay. I'm definitely going to come back to you when he's, uh, when he's going to perform. Mm. And uh, definitely, uh, I'm, I know they're keeping him for the end. So definitely it's just a blanche while he will actually perform. Uh, you know, uh, my dad's call was in uh, Duella. Mm -hmm. So blanche while he started the show today. So definitely it's going to be uh, maybe at the end of this particular uh, ceremony. So there's a lot uh, to be expected here today. He flew all the way from Nigeria to be in this particular event. So definitely he's going to perform one way or the other. We're going to give you more information as the ceremony arises. There's definitely much in the store as the ceremony unfolds. We are at the Yaoundé Hilton Hotel where the premiere of A Man for the Weekend produced by Cindy Emade and her Blue Rain Entertainment is currently going on. Just listen there to our man of the field, Valerie Tata Dulafe, giving us his first impressions from that end. Just to mention that the ceremony began um, a while ago and the guests to that event are about now uh, being uh, entertained uh, uh, with the movie itself which has been screened in one of the halls at the Yawunde Hilton just to mention that um, it is the second film that is being uh, premiered in Yaoundé. In just uh, uh, 72 hours or so, the previous one was um, Married Single 
produced by one of Yaoundé's uh, frontline film producers and directed by LT. Jack, this is Apex One Radio. We are broadcasting from the United States of America. It's Sunday, the 5th of November, 2017. Maxel Ajid is at the other side of Apex One Radio in Valsic, Switzerland, rolling the buttons. And for presentation in the studio, my name is Enes Kanjo. Let's have some music. Then we'll be right back with you in just a couple of minutes. Est-ce que tu comprends que tu dois dégager 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 
From Guy Lopez, dégagé to Marcel Thiaïs Souveni, Yakati Molar Mozart, beautiful piece of music there, which has put the time to 24 minutes past four here in the studio of Apex One Radio, 24 minutes past 10 in Yaoundé. And precisely at the Houston Hotel from where a man for the weekend is being officially presented to the public. The movie is produced by Cindy Imade and directed by Achille Bryce. It's already seen the light of day in Douala. That was precisely on the 28th of October 2017, last week at the Canal Olympia in Duala. And today, Hilton Hotel, Yaoundé has taken the command button. And so, we are on Apex One Radio this day, the 5th of November 2017, on a special broadcast session devoted to the live coverage of the movie premiere of a man for the week. And Marcel Adilis and Vatus, Switzerland, producing this uh, broadcast session. And my name is NS Kanjo. Collaboration is coming from Gracie Boise, Tabi for King Solomon, at Wanchia Cynthia to whom I want to say congratulations on the birth of a bouncy baby girl. Shivonete is also monitoring the show. And of course, this is Apex One Radio Music. Gaston, pourquoi tu es si triste, mon frère? Dis donc, les affaires, ça ne tourne plus, hein? Ah bon? On a serré, 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 serré tout. <laughs> ah, je vois.
That beautiful piece of Makosa there has brought the time to 29 minutes past four here in the studio of Apex One Radio. It's 29 minutes past 10 in Yawunde, Cameroon, precisely at the Hilton Hotel from where the movie premiere of A Man for the Weekend is taking place. Remember that last week, precisely on the 28th of October, the movie was premiered at the Canal Olympia in Douala. Just to mention that A Man for the Weekend is produced by Cindy Emade and her Blue Rain Entertainment. That movie stars frontline actors, including Cindy Emade herself, Kwa Kingsley, Chief of Valerie Solange Ojo, and Nollywood's Alex Ekubo. It was shot a couple of months ago, and so it's being presented to the public officially. And of course, our man Valerie Tata Dulafi has been at the Hilton Hotel watching that event for Apex One Region, of course, giving us minute by minute report reports from that end. We shall soon go back to Yaoundé from where Valerie will be telling us what would have transpired since we last had him on the airways. But for now, let's continue listening to beautiful piece of music. This one is titled Edit by Cotobas and it is a special dedication to my very good friend Marine Dakwe who doubles as the manager of the Sea Boy. She's currently listening to us from MN, that is Minnesota here in the United States of America. Let's ride on with music. Thank you. 
Chérie, a 1986 piece of music there by Miss Sengo Francois is reaching you from Apex One Radio. This day, November the 5th, 2017, we are currently at the Hilton Hotel in Yaoundé covering the premiere of A Man for the Weekend. Within the past couple of minutes, it's been a silent face of the event because guests to uh, that premiere were watching the screening of the movie. Well, let's go back there and find out just what happened. Has transpired since then. Valerie Tata Dulafe, what's up? Any updates? Definitely, in this country, you guys welcome uh, once more to the United States of America. Welcome uh, once more to uh, the on the Hilton Hotel. We're definitely uh, man for a weekend. Is definitely the premiere that is actually making hit waves. Gamo and Plus we present here today, and we are at the projection of the movie Ernest Ganjo, and definitely it is um, a great, great, great ceremony. So, I guess I just got some few people in the copper right now who made this event uh, uh, happen. Maybe I'll start by, by Chi Chi. Uh, Chi Chi, who is definitely uh, the event manager of this particular event from Duala. And right now, to you on the red carpet event, the most anticipated event, as many people attempted, with boy and the rest right here, thanks to one of 
the family members, as Cindy Made actually revealed, as well about family. So, Chichi, welcome once more to Apex on Radio in the United States. Hi, Josie. Thank you very much for having me. Shout out to NS Kanjo. <laughs> It's always fun being on Apex on radio. Mm. Yeah, we'll give you the first opportunity to address one question to Chichi before I can start with him. Yeah, uh, Chichi, welcome to Apex One Radio. Thank you very much, Enes Kanjo. Yeah, I understand that um, you are just coming from Douala where you had a similar uh, event. Tell me, what did it take uh, your team to organize such a sumptuous event which you are presenting to the public today? First of all, it's all about vision, you know. It's, it's, it's when, when, when Cindy contacted me with the project and she told me, Chichi, what can you do, you know, with this? I said, okay, this is, I will take this and make it the next big thing in Cameroon Entertainment. And so, um, it, 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 it took me from branding the whole concept of the movie, not based on any director or any, or the producer or the actors in the movie, but making a man for the weekend trend like a trademark, you know, mm. taking it as a product that is on a virgin soil. I decided to take the project as something that has never existed, okay. as if movie and premiums have never existed in Cameroon. And so I said, okay, I was going to take this and bring an experience that we watch only on TV in neighboring countries like Nigeria, Ghana, South Africa, and we watch in the United States. I said, okay, this experience can also be felt in Cameroon. And so uh, I put I put I put my team on work and I I created a vision and I said okay this is what we want to get and so we create all different avenues for us to be able to achieve our objective which was bringing glamour to the red carpet and to movie premieres and entertainment as a whole in Cameroon definitely teach it before I take leave for you. <laughs> Yes, Anders. Yes, permit me ask one more question uh, to Chichi before uh, you continue from that end. Now, uh, Chichi, uh, at the Douala event, we observed something which was out of the ordinary. We uh, saw a green backdrop with just the title of the movie without uh, logos of uh, maybe uh, 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 partners. Tell me, where is this concept coming from and just how did the public appreciate uh, this idea. Uh, uh, first, first of all, um, and it's, uh, I'm somebody who loves to dare, you know. And like I termed this event in French, in uh, événement à deux tapis. That means it was an event with two carpets, the blue carpet and the red carpet. Okay. And so I wanted to bring another approach. I wanted to bring glamour. Everybody knows. Yes, we have partners. We have sponsors. You know who we have to recognize when we have a carpet and. So uh, uh, the, the blue carpet, which represents blue ring entertainment, mm. and that's where we have the logos of all the partners. Okay. And then the green background and the logo being uh, 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 sculpted and uh, and put on it was was part of the branding of the concept, A Man for the Weekend, which I chose to make it go viral as mm. a trademark. And so I wanted it to stand out and not get lost amongst the other logos and every other thing. So. I, I, I went for this to be able to make a man for the weekend stand out as, as an entity on its own, you know, bringing glamour to the carpet. Mm. Well, thank you very much, Ernest. And after this, Chichi, what is the next step for this particular movie? How do we get this? Okay, um, one other thing which is common in Cameroon cinema and in between is that we always see our premieres and we never get to watch the movies, you know. One, one, one of the things we're putting in place is we, we, we're going to be streaming these movies in different towns in Cameroon. And also we're going to do it premieres. Uh, January we're going to London and we'll be doing the premiere in London. We're going to premiere in the US, in London, uh, and, and in, in Lagos. Lagos, no, we're going to Lagos in, in, in London. We're going to also premiere in the US and in the UK. And so after that, we're going to meet the movie available to every every citizen in Cameroon. And I don't want to reveal to you the package that has been prepared to be able to distribute this movie in and out of Cameroon. And I promise you this movie, like um is been rated by the Ministry of Culture that for uh, category S, that is it is it should be viewed by everybody. So it it is it is going to be we are going to make it reach everybody in this country.
Well, thank you very much, uh, GT, for having uh, spoken to us, and definitely it is a good movie, and uh, we hope to come back to in the Cops Power programs. Thank, thank you very much. Dorothy. Thank you very much. And as that was uh, uh, Chichi, who happens to be the event uh, manager, will definitely uh, try to catch one or two uh, red carpet uh, hosts as we are, are, are speaking. Definitely. Uh, we're going to step over to one or two people once more. And this is the red carpet of uh, the chairman known as a man for the weekend. It is a, a, a ceremony. My eyes are wandering like up and down. I'm definitely trying to catch one or two people again for us to um, maybe bring you to you live of uh, what is happening. Maybe uh, before uh, I can sit in you're ready, you're taking uh, snapshots and uh, definitely get into uh, meet one or two people. We'll definitely try to catch up with her. In just a, a couple of seconds, maybe uh, time for us to catch one of uh, the persons who definitely uh, made uh, uh, Cindy uh, Cindy watch it today. If, yeah, she started off as I definitely uh, revealed to you as a, a model. A model definitely. She, for those of you who knew her, she was uh, into pictures and all. She was. Uh, she is a great personality when it comes to to pictures and modeling. Maybe uh, Ernest Kanji. I might try to to, to, to catch her right now so as to make people understand what is going on. Okay, she's still uh, doing the let, Let's go over to Fred Ash uh, and Escanjo. And definitely, uh, this great guy, I've most of I told you, uh, since the mother's name is actually written in the uh, in the palms I say for this guy. Many people uh, discovered Cynthia Made when she was still a, a model, one time model in the Heritage Cameroon. And definitely mm. uh, there's this guy who's been making it big when it comes to pictures. And definitely Cynthia's been working for Fredash. Welcome to Apex Radio in the United States. Ah uh, thank you. Thank you so much. I know seeing Cindy 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 uh going to become the leader as she is, we definitely know uh she started somewhere with you and Benny when she was finished in university. And uh, how is it like seeing her grow? Yeah, Cindy is uh, she's a uh, bright, she's a bright, and uh, seeing how she is today, it gives me so much joy. That's why you see I'm still with her right now. Mm -hmm. Wherever she goes, I know you see me well, wherever I go, you see her. Yeah, so it's a clique that uh, uh, we uh, we form, not just me and Cindy, but other models, other designers that uh, I seek to promote. Cindy's a sister; she's a partner right now, even from a model to a partner. Yeah. She's doing big, and uh, I just I just wish her the best in the industry and my life. And with Fred Ash, he's doing strength after strength. What is the strength of Fred Ash? No, it's just here and there. Uh, it's just uh, my belief, the, the inner me and the God of the, you know, because it's not been easy for over, um, over eight years today. It's not been easy. I just believe in my, the, the, the inner me, you know, something inside me that tells you that do this, you believe in yourself, do in your God. So there's no magic, it's just my inner self and my God and the people around me. So thank you very much, Fred Ash. Definitely, Cindy Amade, for those of you uh, who are friends of Fred Ash, he is in Guinea yeah. and definitely has been to be big in the, in the, in the, in the photo sector and, and the fashion industry as well. <laughs> Previously, we do one of Kamon's biggest fashion events. Yeah. It's called FIAFA. Yeah, and, and, and right now, we are looking at Kamon's Fashion Awards. Oh, yeah. They'll we'll come here because it'll be sometime November 28th. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. We do our, uh, mm -hmm. our we want to uh, promote and, uh, and recognize or we'll promote Kamon fashion. Oh, yeah. Kamon things, African things. Like we have a category like the best uh, costume movie, mm -hmm. best uh, costume video, video, mm -hmm. best just action and actor, uh, best designer, action and so forth. Yes, okay. So thank you very much for that. We'll definitely see how we can make uh, that uh, particular event uh, in Kukas and Apis Mori. So thank you very much for coming. Thank you. All right, I guess I'm going to step over so to try to get one or two people again. Maybe I should... Uh, I'm, I'm going to try to get uh, maybe... Uh, uh, in, in the Amade, uh, uh, so as to say, she's still taking on our pictures, and she, 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 she's still in the red carpet, our pictures and, and stuff like that. Maybe we will be, and we'll get uh, to her in just a couple of seconds, you know, uh, picture time and, and, and all. So just give me uh, a couple of seconds, do not go away. Maybe I should get uh, Cindy, Cindy Amade, Office on Radio, welcome to Office on Radio, and definitely a beautiful movie. Thank you. Always the best. Always the best. So, Cindy, definitely, uh, you, you have been in this particular industry for quite a long time. Now, seeing these these people who are definitely here for you, how do you feel after this particular? I know the premise is going on. But how? How? What, what is your feeling? 
Well, uh, I, I keep saying this is like a dream come true, an amazing, amazing turnout, just like in Douala, and I can't thank God enough, I can't thank the people who are behind this, the team who have become a family, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm super excited today, I'm, I'm just happy with the turnout, I'm happy that everyone is out here to appreciate the movie. And definitely you're well dressed and everything, you're looking like a princess and stuff like that, so Cindy, I've been talking to Chi Chi and the rest, and they, 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 they have quite a huge project after this particular film. What is the next uh, stop for Cindy? Well, actually, um, for Cindy, a lot of projects. Of course, but for Blu-ray, we have many things coming up. We are taking this movie to the world, definitely. Mm. And of course, we are preparing for the next movie already by Blu-ray. Definitely. Okay, so thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, Cindy. Definitely. Uh, we know you have been doing it quite big. I know you have not been using for this particular movie. So uh, we thank you very much for bringing this out to the public. I will leave you uh, to your gift. I know many people want to get to you, and definitely we'll come back to you when they give you any direct. Right. Thank you, Valerie. Thank you, you are awesome, of course. You know this is your thing already. Thanks for coming out always. Epic One Radio, the best. <laughs> of course. So you heard it from Cindy. And can we thank you very much, Cindy? You heard it from, uh, uh, from Cindy Amade. It has uh, been a great, great, great pleasure. And uh, it's been so much uh, fun here on the red carpet. The premiere is still uh, going on earnest. And uh, we still uh, see one or two people definitely stepping out and having uh, shoots, we should get better. And uh, and as I'm going to leave, leave you guys for a bit. Time for me to to get more information like in two seconds, and I'll be back with you guys. Over to you in the studio. He will definitely be back. His name is Valerie Tata Dulafe. He is our man at the Hilton Hotel. <laughs> Currently covering the premiere of A Man for the Weekend is Cindy Imade production. And that movie is being officially presented to the Yaoundé public this day, November the 5th, 2017. Valerie just spoke there uh, to the producer of that movie who is visibly uh, glad that um, it has gone this far. And a while ago, Valerie spoke to the guy who is at the helm of the organization of this um, uh, campaign. Eh? I call it a campaign because uh, a man for the weekend is currently on the train and we are told that after Yaoundé, the movie will definitely be presented to the London public in the United Kingdom. Thereafter, USA will surely be the next stop. And Lagos, Nigeria is also expecting a man for the weekend and, and so that is how it is happening today at the Hilton Hotel in Yaoundé where people have converged to see this other new product eh, that is being uh, presented to the entertainment world, precisely the one of Africa. This is Apex World Radio. We are broadcasting from the United States of America and from Cameroon, respectively. Valerie Tata Dulafin. Uh, NS Kanjo, Marcel, Adi Gracie, Boise, and the rest of the team are keeping you company this Sunday evening. Let's have some music, then we'll be right back with you. It's Canal and the Oh, next day. Okay. La la, la la, la la, la la. Qu'est-ce que tu sais? C'est toi que j'aime. Please don't go, baby. Faut pas compliquer. Et pour jamais, je t'aimerai. T'en fais pas, baby. Faut pas compliquer. Et si jamais on t'avait trompé, laisse tomber le passé. Prends la main, laisse-moi te guider Brillant sous le soleil De l'amour éternel Rassure-toi Je ne quitterai pas You be my love Baby, faut pas compliquer Quoi que ça soit Tu resteras dans mon cœur Chouchou, faut pas compliquer que tu as peur d'être blessé Mais cette fois c'est vrai, bébé Si jamais tu penses à me quitter 
baby girl, mon cœur, sèche comme une fleur. Et puis, pour plus en plus de détails, il ne faut pas compliquer. By Wax, il y a un de temps pour 4 minutes pour 5 ans. Le studio de Apex One Radio, c'est exactement 4 minutes pour 11 à la Hilton Hotel in Yonder, from where our man Valérie Tata Dulafi a been given us minute by minute commentaries on what is going on out there. A man for the weekend is what is happening this weekend. Let's move on to beautiful music by one of the artists who will be performing tonight at the Hilton. His name is Wiz Boy. He is from Niger. Let's go. For you, I wanna sing the song, girl. Let's go. Say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What has been termed a very great event happening in Yaoundé tonight is um, the hunting work of a very young yet talented and very focused Cameroonian entertainer. Her name is uh, Cindy Imade, who is an actress. She has um, starred or featured in scores of uh, films, including some of the best TV series the country has uh, had within the past two years. I'm talking about Bad Angel and the Rumble. She uh, uh, she moved up to the status of film producer and uh, did Rose on the Grave, which was premiered in 2015. And Cindy has come back this time with A Man for the Weekend, which has been highly publicized within the past couple of weeks. And the film has been presented to the public officially in a campaign that has just begun. Last week it was Duwala at the Canal Olympic. This week it is Yaoundé at the Hilton Hotel. Perhaps uh, the next stopover will be London in the United Kingdom. We are also told that the film will make a stopover in the United States of America and Lagos in Nigeria. So that is the story of The Man for the Weekend, which has been told already. Movie produced by Blue Rain Entertainment and Sydney. And of course, directed by Ashil Bryce, Apex One Radio is also contributing its own quarter in the promotion of this very gigantic project. And so, we are live at the Yonder Hilton Hotel with our man Valerie Tata Dulavin, who is giving us live commentaries from that and Axel Adidas in Vansut, Switzerland, producing this broadcast session. My name is Ernest Kanjo. Let's ride on with beautiful music.
Hey, do life's happenings still appear strange to you? Do certain occurrences make you feel you belong to a different planet other than Earth? Do you still live in disbelief? Okay, come back to Earth where reality obtains, where life happens. Life Happens is a radio show that breaks such life myths and prepares you to tackle reality, yet succeeding in your end divorce. On Life Happens, we bring those issues on the table and chart a way forward. Join Gracie Boise and her panel of intelligent people as they dissect the issues. Send your views a calls by calling the show at 001-614-266-5611 or text us on WhatsApp through the same number or inbox Gracie Boise on Facebook, G-R-A-C-E-E-B-O-Y-C-E-E. Life Happens is every Saturday from 4 to 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is also 9 to 11 p.m. in Lagos, Nigeria. Life Happens only on Apex One Radio. Get on board. Let's happen along with life. How much of Africa do you know in terms of geography, history, politics, economics, tourism, sports, and cuisine? How much of African music do you get to listen to or dance to? Who are those Africans who inspire you and make you dream to reach the apex? Find out more about the continent in African Fiesta. African Fiesta is a midweek magazine that brings African values to the platform and presents them to the rest of the world. African Fiesta is information, education, education, and entertainment. African Fiesta is every Wednesday at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is 3 p.m. in Limbe, Cameroon, Lagos, Nigeria, and 3 p.m. in Lome, Togo. African Fiesta, just on Apex One Radio. Join us for the feast. Join us for the feast. And today we are feasting with uh, the crew of A Man for the Weekend. And so, what is happening this weekend? Definitely, A Man for the Weekend is what is happening this weekend. Valerie Tatala joins us once again from the Hilton Hotel in Yaoundé. Valerie, welcome back. Thank you very much, Ernest. It is uh, a distinguished pleasure to, to have you here on uh, the red carpet that is in uh, Yaoundé. And definitely, things are unfolding. In a, in, a, in a positive way, definitely everything is is, is is good right here. Maybe I can I can see some one or two persons definitely having a, a, a great time here on uh, the red carpet, and definitely as uh, the case might be, actors and actresses streaming in, streaming in, streaming in, and we still have uh, uh, this beautiful lady known as uh, Ken Lee who is definitely here on uh, the red carpet of uh, Man of for the weekend. So. Candy is here, all dressed in green and beautiful. And Candy, welcome once more to Apex One. It's already your home. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Valerie. Hello, Ernest. Hello, Hello Candy. Candy. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you. Mm. Welcome to so, Apex One. So, Ernest, you have the first question for Candy. Yes, uh, uh, Kanji, I understand that um, within the past couple of weeks it's been from one movie premiere to the other. Tell us about this one. How do you feel being part of uh, the premiere of A Man for the Weekend today in Yaoundé? Uh, well, I want to first of all start by saying a big congratulations to Cindy. This is a great job. It's a job well done. I'm so proud of her. I'm so proud that we Cameroonians are going higher high. This is um, a job that was well done. The story, perfect. Cast, wonderful. The crew was just on point. So I'm happy to be here. I'm happy that I'm part of this. I'm happy I could make out the time to come support our own. I couldn't just let it pass by, you know. <laughs> and it's fun getting to meet everybody in the industry because so many people traveled from far and wide to make it here. So... I think it was a great movie. It is a great movie, and I'm so happy and so proud to be Cameroonian and to be part of a man for the weekend. Now, now can you tell us a little bit, you know, after this uh, particular premiere, we actually met you last, uh, just a couple of days ago, 
uh, for another premier. Now, tell us, after this particular, you know, launches here and there, what's up for her? I don't want to let the cat out of the bag, so I'm not going to say anything. But of course, there's definitely something cooking. Definitely, something is cooking. There's <laughs> always something cooking. Something is cooking in the pot, as I was <laughs> because she will be coming up the show very, very soon, exactly. and we get this uh, cooking show. Yeah. And definitely, uh, we are we're going to have time to talk about that particular show and to get listeners what it's all about. Of course. So thank you very much, Candy. Keep looking beautiful. <laughs> thank Keep you, making so <laughs> Thank you very much. I know that is Candy, definitely. Is, uh, also, uh, also our guest in last uh, show. It is a great uh, a ceremony. Uh, this, uh, everything is unfolding uh, back there in uh, the set room. I have confirmation also that Alex is in the room. Alex is in the hall. Uh, and uh, it seems the, the premise is still going on. Uh, the film is still uh, rolling. So uh, we we'll definitely uh, maybe uh, get Alex at the end of the show because I uh, couldn't step out. He had to step out because uh, uh, definitely we had we had her cornered uh, somewhere when he when she stepped out to uh, to to do one of the things. You know, she's the producer of this particular movie, so she steps uh, in and out from from time to time to just to make sure every, everything is uh, going on well. So Ernest, everything is going on in the hall. I just wanted to to let you know that uh, confirm the presence of Alex. We spoke to Nigeria is also uh, here. We, we we had them uh, confirmed in this particular ceremony. So they are around, and definitely when the time will come, if the life is still going, we will definitely catch them in the, in the course of this program. We'll definitely uh, come back to that and we'll definitely have the opportunity of speaking with uh, one of Africa's frontline movie actors, Alex Kobo of Nollywood, who is um, currently taking part at the movie premiere of A Man for the Weekend, in which he is starring alongside Chifo Valerie Solange Ojong Cindy Imade, Nkwa Kingsley and a host of other uh, great actors and actresses. The movie is directed by Ashil Bryce and produced by Blue Rain Entertainment. Men. And like we've been mentioning all along, this movie is going to be premiered in other cities around the world, including London in the United Kingdom, Lagos in Nigeria, and of course in some cities in the United States of America. Currently, it is being presented to the public in Yaoundé, Cameroon, from where Apex One Radio has been giving you minute-by-minute minute commentaries uh, with uh, Valerie Dulafi at the um, and from the Ohio end of the station, it is NS Kanjo in Versus, Switzerland. We have Maxel Aji producing the show. It's exactly six minutes past five here in the studio of Apex One Radio. Six minutes past 11 in Yawunde. Six minutes past... Um, Five in Maryland, United States of America, from where we have uh, lots and lots of people listening to the show. Nine minutes uh, past uh, four in Minnesota, from where Marie Ndakwe is listening to Apex One Radio Music. And this time it's uh, Romeo, still by Whistboy, one of the artists who will be performing at the Hilton this evening. Let's go. It's another one. Wee's <laughs> boy. Yes. Let's go, Let's go, Let's go, Let's go. 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 Let's go.
A beautiful piece of music there by Wiz Boy, one of the artists, of course, the guest artist at the Yonder Hilton Hotel at the premiere of A Man for the Week. And we're definitely going to uh, not only catch a glimpse of the artist, but he's definitely going to speak on FX1 Radio. Let's find out if Dulafe is in touch with uh, Wiz Boy. Dulafe, welcome back. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ernest. Definitely, uh, Wiz Boy is out here. He just uh, stepped out, so definitely. Um, the uh, ground one or two uh, interviews. He's uh, from Nigeria, and he he made it right here. And uh, first of all, he's in a red carpet interview with uh, uh, the mother uh, uh, station. Mm. So he's definitely here, and uh, it is a, a, a grandiose uh, ceremony. With boy definitely uh, uh, get, getting into an interview. And when, when we finish, we'll definitely try to get with boy because he's going to get uh, to uh, the red carpet and definitely get uh, interviewed by Maya. I promise you, so just stay tuned uh, so that he he gets uh, through with, uh, with with the red carpet uh, 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 guys. And uh, we'll definitely we'll definitely catch him. He's definitely uh, with us. He's going to be with us because Apex One Radio never uh, stops at nothing. Uh, they always uh, strive to get the best, so that's that's how it is, and we'll definitely try to get him here on on, on Apex One Radio. So let, let me arrange that, and we'll definitely uh, catch up with him in just a couple a couple of seconds. And, uh, okay, we so, uh, uh, that's how it is here, and uh, definitely, and as you can just stay tuned. He's definitely here. So when you when you get finished, we'll, we'll just take him. He's now at the uh, the red carpet. Mm. Uh, surrounded by fans, and I just uh, he, he he's actually having fun, and you know you know Cameroonians, he's actually being loved oh so much, so much, so much, so much. 
in the Cameroonian uh, uh, in, in industry. So uh, definitely, definitely uh, so uh, and uh, yeah, just stay tuned. And next, we will have uh, the, the opportunity to to, to to take him in just a couple of seconds. It is a, a great, great, great ceremony here. So uh, yeah. So that's that's how we do. So many people around him right now, and that we'll definitely get him right here when uh, uh, the mother session is, is, is still with him. Definitely, I, I think the, the the film, the projection of the film, uh, just ended. So we are very much proud to to to, to have him here. So Ennis, just stay tuned, and we will have him. Maybe I catch which maybe I catch which boy right now and stuff like that. So. Okay, they're still rolling. They're still rolling with 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 this ball. And as you guys should just stay tuned. It is you know you know how it is with uh, you know it is with the ladies to get them. It's not that easy. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and of course, so uh, to get them it's not that easy. But we we we'll just have to do everything so as to so as to get them here. So it will be soon. Very it will be too very soon, Ennis. So just stay tuned, and uh, we will we'll catch him up. He's all the way from Nigeria, dressed in, in black. He's all the way dressed in black, black shoes, black trousers, black belt, and uh, a shirt. It's all about glamour this particular uh, evening. So uh, some people are already calling him the man for the week already. He's been doing big in the music industry. And I know you guys are listening to his songs uh, right there in uh, the United States of America right now. A great, a great guy will just steal some just some few minutes and try to get to him because I'm I'm sure he's going to perform in just a, a couple of, of seconds from now. So definitely, we are, I promise we are going to get him on air, uh, no matter what, no matter the protocol. We're definitely going to catch him straight up immediately. He's uh, he's still from the mother station, and we'll definitely catch catch him up. He's, uh, you know, events like this don't happen every day in Cameroon. Uh, celebrities like this don't come every day in Cameroon. But for Wisboy to be here in uh, Cameroon for this particular premiere, it means it's a uh, it, 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 it's a great it's a great it's a great deal. So the whole is filled uh, to the brim. And that's you. For those of you definitely uh, know the on the Hilton Hotel, it is it is actually filled, and no, I mean, there's no place that is there's no seat. That is empty. Every uh, seat has been occupied by one or two, or, or two persons. So that's how we do it here. And let's, let's just catch him maybe just for two seconds and definitely we'll be back. Which so board? Welcome to Apex One Radio. Okay. I'm okay, the radio. Okay. The radio. <laughs> it is a pleasure to receive you here in Cameroon. Yeah, yeah. Pleasure to receive you. Oh, yes. So, uh, which board? Definitely, uh, definitely. You, you have been in Cameroon for this uh, particular event. And uh, how do you feel like in Cameroon? Just in yeah, yeah, I feel so. I feel so blessed. I feel so. Um, it, it's an awesome thing to be part of this project because Cindy is my friend, and she told me, and I have to be here, and I have to make out time wear my shirt to be here. And I mean, the environment is, 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 is love all over the place, and the movie is mind blowing. So you guys watch out for it. The man for the weekend. Have a beautiful night, before. Thank you for coming. And of course, a rich boy from uh, Nigeria, and definitely you, you must have gotten love from him. We have to catch him because he has to perform in just a couple of seconds, as I promised you. We caught him, and definitely, this one really will never take more for a nine, so no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Dulafe, uh, for catching a glimpse of this uh, boy there who actually. Uh, you have 11. Said that he enjoys uh, being out there and that uh, Cindy Imadi has been uh, a friend and he's very pleased to be part of uh, the Young Producers uh, Project. And like you mentioned earlier on, uh, Wisboy is stepping back into the hall to definitely have his own uh, part of the event this evening. I mean, his performance, which is what the public here uh, is definitely awaiting with uh, uh, sufficient anxiety. Okay, thank you so much, uh, Dulafi. We'll definitely come back to you for more information from that end. Time for us to listen to Wizboy from this end. Even if we, we cannot watch the artist perform live, we can at least listen to his music from this end. But then, Dulafi is our eye out there. Let him watch Wizboy live on the stage for us. But then, let's listen to his music from this end. 
Salambala, beautiful piece of music there by Whisper, that young Nigerian artist who has given high life music a modern twist, and of course, it has come out to be a very palatable piece of sound which you would love to listen to again and again. And of course, Whisper is performing at the Yaoundé Hilton Hotel this evening. Where the premiere of A Man for the Weekend, produced by Cindy Mari, is being always happening. Eh? Our man Tata Dulafi has been with us since then. And of course, uh, we are doing the last segment of this special broadcast on Apex One Radio this day, the 5th of November 2017. When we go back to Yaoundé, will definitely be uh, the last uh, call for Valerie Tata Dulafi. Beautiful music from this end. Can nobody love you like I do, my baby? Oh, one plus one 
this one Now it be the melody, I go to play you forever Yeah, nobody treat you like I do my baby, oh yeah. You are the personality, the sugar in my tea, my testimony The probability is equal to unity of a matrimony This love is traced to the power of infinity Girl, now you the ginger my dignity hey. Strong thing is what I'm feeling, baby mm -hmm. yeah. 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 And I say Love plus one is one Now you be the arithmetic when we keep us together Can't nobody love you like that do my baby This one, the end of the melody, I go to play you forever. Yeah, nobody treats you like I do, my baby. Get us to make it a loving. Get us to make it a loving. Tuning in with Apex One Radio. Stay with us on www.apexoneradio.com. Apex One Radio, your radio. Hey friends, come to think of this. The world has become so competitive and giving birth to people we describe as movers and shakers. See how they excel in their craft and contribute to the development of their community and their society. Their stories are fascinating and inspiring. Their examples are worth emulating. Their successes are great. Here comes a platform that tells those stories with the people behind them coming on board to do so. On board with... We started with uh, Dry Bones by Alexis. I mean, we are definitely going to end with Dry Bones. Let's go back to the Yaoundé Hilton and find out just what has been happening. And it is going to be the last segment of this uh, broadcast. I understand that uh, the event is uh, gradually coming to an end, at least for part one of it. Part two will definitely be party, party, party. Valérie Tata de la Fée, is that the case? What about this last phase? Thank you very much, Ernest. Uh, you guys are going to be absolutely with the noise because we're going to actually uh, giving a spectacular performance right now here at the Expo Radio and to the lovers of the only music at the Yaoundé the Indigenous Hotel, the lovers of uh, Nigerian African music as well. At the moment, we get to the party on uh, it's been a popular song, uh, one to every one. Uh, We definitely did uh, Love and Giant Hit. We did uh, another song for this uh, slide. And now we're seeing what we're from. And we started a great time here uh, uh, with the community population. We want to get from the background. It's the last phase of the particular uh, ceremony. And it's actually a community for Blanche Bible. And they are in a beautiful time. And that was really an official video as well, uh, and that's all good. They are so much having fun here. The population is going to be at the moment, I've been going to visit from the party out. It's good for us in Nigeria. And uh, it's actually pushing down the particular, this particular event. All things are lined up. Everybody is on uh, Snapchat. Everybody is on the phone recording. Good for 
Yes, Valérie Tata Dula fait 5 on 5. Definitely, uh, that was his point. We just performed as much. You have something else to ask me, but I think, man, that has been uh, the highlights of this particular event. And, and man, it, 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 things are getting all, uh, it's almost getting over from this particular end. The MC is actually uh, closing up the, sh the show for today. Maybe I may take a step out to uh, to, to, to close this particular this particular event. And uh, I'm stepping out of the hall already. Yes, and now we have a, 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 a quiet atmosphere. Okay, so the, the show is getting to an end. Yes, Kanjo, it's getting to an end already. And uh, the hall is still uh, filled with people. But I just want to step out to tell you guys. It is almost uh, over from this uh, end, and uh, people will soon start uh, leaving uh, the hall. But it has been a great ceremony, and definitely uh, I, I can't, you know, uh, take one one or two people again because you know the rush, the rush, rush from the on the Hilton Hotel and security and everything. People are rushing and rushing and rushing. Everybody is just set uh, to start uh, kicking very fast to get uh, caps and taxis. Uh, and actually at home. So that's how it is, and it's kind of except there's another thing you want me to highlight before uh, we definitely say, man, it has been a great pleasure from this day. Yes, Valérie Tata de la Fée, just uh, one uh, last question before you take leave of us. Uh, in less than 36 hours, Yaoundé has hosted two uh, great media events. That is the premiere of um, Married Single, and today we are having that of a man for the weekend. It is uh, yeah. uh, not very uh, uh, common that we have uh, this happening in Yaoundé. What is your assessment, uh, Valérie Tata Dulafe, and would you see this as um, a great advancement in the film industry in Cameroon that within 36 hours a city is hosting two great events as this one? Definitely, Ernest Kanjo, you know, in just uh, uh, three days Cameroon has hosted, no, I want to say the Yaoundé Hilton Hotel, has hosted uh, a beautiful uh, film launch that is uh, married and single. And right now, we have uh, a man for the weekend at the Young the Hilton Hotel. For those of you who know the Hilton Hotel, it's not a less than a million francs to get the whole here. So definitely for a uh, film holder, for film, for film guys to uh, take this initiative to make it class and glamorous, it is first of all a plus. That is it. So on uh, the two films that we have watched, uh, they are of uh, good class because uh, definitely before you can also be on the Hilton Hotel, that means you should have your belt around your pants. I'm talking, I'm saying that in the right way, in a very positive way. Uh, the, it has been a great, great success to poor people every night. It's not easy for people to leave and be out at this particular point in time to watch a film. And there's, there is something I would like to highlight before leaving you. There is something I would need to highlight, very important. You know, the the essence, you know, the culture of coming back to watch films is definitely on a rise. People now find pleasure stepping out from their homes, not only sitting in front of their plasma screens and watching movies. Now they are stepping out to definitely watch films. That's to say, uh, when I watched the hall for today, and you see the turnout of people who are here today, these people came out to watch a particular movie. That's to say, if uh, events like this are organized in Cameroon, and most of the time, the culture of bringing back our films into the cinema halls, in theaters, and everything is going to be a call for success. 
So people are urged, people are urging to watch this particular movies, and then they don't just have, they don't have the arena or the opportunity to watch these movies. Let me give you an anecdote, and it's going to and a very shocking revelation. Mm. Uh, the tickets for this particular movies, uh, movie were, was sold at 16,000 francs, uh, 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 classic, uh, 30,000 francs VIP, and 50,000 francs VIP couple. That's to tell you something. You know, if Cameroonians can pay this sum just to go and watch a movie, that's 15,000 francs for the minimum person, 30,000 francs for, for, for VIP, and 50,000 francs for VIP couple, that means everything can be possible in Cameroon. A couple of days for married and single with tickets, we are about 5,000 francs, 10,000 francs, or 30,000 francs to stay. So people have the money, they have the money to actually uh, support these Cameroonian filmmakers, now it's left for these Cameroonian filmmakers to bring the goods to them. So that's what I can actually tell the NS can do. That's my take in this particular uh, say. It is a beautiful, glamorous event. Two films in the Yawanda Hilton Hotel, Apex from Radio has been there. Of course, we have been there because we are at the Apex. Because we are at the Apex, we have been there. Valerie Tata Dulafe, thank you so much. Uh, I do have a fantastic rest of the Saturday out there at the Hilton Hotel in Yaoundé, from where you have been reporting. Thank you so much. And that was our man, Valerie Tata Dulafe, signing off from the Hilton Hotel. The Hilton, where the premiere of A Man for the Weekend has been taking place. And so, like Valerie mentioned earlier on the culture of uh, uh, movie theaters is gradually coming back into the limelight. It actually went into thin air a couple of years back when uh, the last of the cinema halls were folded up. I'm talking about Cinema Abia, Cinema Lampir in Bafusam, Cinema Rovuri in Douala, and of course, some years back, Roxy International, and of course, uh, those uh, other cinema halls which you and I know about were all folded up and the culture of theater disappeared into thin air but then of late it's been coming back reason why people can leave their houses you know and go watch films uh, nowadays even with um, uh, uh, tickets that are sold at high cost, eh? 15,000 francs, 30,000 francs, 60,000 francs for VIP and people are able to afford these uh, 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 amounts to go sit down and watch movies. It is something to write home about. And so that is how we saw the live coverage of uh, the movie premiere of A Man for the Weekend today in Yaoundé, Cameroon, from where Valerie Tata Dulafe was uh, reporting, just to mention that the movie is produced by Cindy Imade and her Blue Rain Entertainment. It is a film that is starring Chief of Valerie, Alex uh, uh, Kubo, uh, Solange Ojong, and a host of other actors. We are told that uh, other cities will also welcome this uh, product, including London in the United Kingdom, some cities in the United States of America, Lagos in Nigeria, and uh, lots of other cities. And so... That is how we put a full stop to this live uh, coverage devoted to a man for the weekend. It's been a fantastic weekend here on Apex One Radio. It began with uh, the live coverage of um, married single still in Yaoundé. And we had our man Valerie Tata Dulafi who was at the helm of that reporting session. Thank you so much for having had a fantastic weekend with us here on Apex One Radio. Special thanks to Marine Dakwe in Minnesota and other listeners of Apex One Radio. On behalf of the team, I want to say thank you once again. This uh, segment of broadcast was produced from Vasuch, Switzerland by Maxel Ajit, hosted by Ernest Kanjo with Valerie Tata Dulafi as our field reporter. Special thanks to our resource reporter uh, Zita Mapala, who has been in Yawunde, Cameroon, monitoring this segment of broadcast. So, do have a fantastic weekend. We love you all. Keep listening to programs on Apex One Radio. And until we meet again, it is bye bye from this end. May God bless you. Oh, yes, I can't eat it all. I can't eat it all.